Hey guys, so I have lately been having a fruit fly problem in my hermit crab tank and um, yeah, so this just started recently. I just started noticing them in there probably like around, I think it was probably around this week, I just started noticing these flies in there and so I looked them, I was pretty sure they were fruit flies so I looked it up and they are, they match the description and all that and um, there are a lot of them. They've been on the food and everything and I haven't really been seeing my hermit crabs like eating the food lately and it's probably because there's these bugs everywhere and my hermit crabs haven't been as active and everything and so um I um looked up how to get rid of fruit flies and so basically I made this like a trap and it has apple cider vin like two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar um, one tablespoon of sugar and like it was supposed to be like a couple liters of water or something like that um, but that seemed like a lot my so I just like put in um, a couple tablespoons of water because it's in a smaller container too so hopefully that'll work if it doesn't work I'll just add more water because maybe the reason that you do need to do that is to like dial down the um, smell like of the dish soap that you also need to put a couple pumps of dish soap in there because the dish soap is what will kill them whenever they go into the trap and so I made that so I'll go ahead and show you I hope that you guys can see like what the fruit flies fruit flies look like on the camera and everything and then I'll show you the the little trap thing that I made and everything like that and um, another thing is don't put that trap inside of the hermit crab tank even though that's where the fruit flies are. Um, I'm probably having this problem actually because I don't have a lid on my tank for um, for one thing I couldn't find one for this, <laughs> the size of my tank and for another reason um, that's pretty much <laughs> actually the only reason why I don't have a lid for my tank which is also bad because of humidity and everything but I do make sure to like mist on my tank and like sometimes I'll put like a little thing over it like this like blanket black black like p blanket type thing sometimes I'll put that over there um but yeah so I'll just go ahead and show you what it what the tank is looking like right now so let's do that well, on the right where the white um, mirror wall thing is you can see the little brown like dots like right here and right here right here those are all um some of the flies and then there's some up here like on this black part and then there's some over here and uh yeah so basically they're just all in different areas they're also on my mirror and stuff they're just like kind of making their way upwards and but they're mostly in this area right here as you can see you can see them the little brown dots around here um but yeah there are, most of them are in this corner because that's where I had my food dish um but since they were all over there I just moved my food dish over here um at, because I had to give them new food and yeah and it was horrible because as soon as I picked up my food dish to go change it out all these like flies just flew out everywhere it's like such a mess right now um and then yeah my hermit crabs are in the coconut hut and like I think the castle stuff like that right now they have not been as active lately and so yeah um so here's the trap I put out I put it right next to my tank because here's my tank and then over here where the, my clock is it has both of these and so yeah uh, so this is the trap here it has the sugar the the soap so I also just put it out a couple minutes ago so I'll like keep you guys updated on if it works if not I will just keep showing you all the other different ways that um, I'll try to get rid of them because I'm not sure exactly um, this is the only way that I really saw and it seemed to be the most simple but a lot of people said it worked well for them so um, I just went ahead and went with this one because we also had all the ingredients for this already in our house and um, yeah so we'll see how it goes and I will keep you all updated hey guys so it is now a couple hours later and I'll just go ahead and show you um, what it's what the tank and everything looks like now so I now see no fruit flies anywhere like remember they were all in this corner and everything and they were also flying around it was kind of hard for you to see them on camera but there was like so many of them everywhere and now I don't see any of them however in the trap I only see like one of them um but so I'm kind of thinking that what must have happened is like the smell or something is like 
it just scared them off or something like that. I'm not exactly sure <laughs> what exactly happened to all of them. Um, so I'm thinking that it's either because the smell like just like made them all leave or maybe because um, I just put carrots in here this time and there weren't wasn't any more like peaches or raspberries or anything like that. So maybe they just, there wasn't really any more food left that they wanted. I don't really know. So basically they all just <laughs> disappeared. I have, and but I only see one that actually fell into the trap. So I'm not exactly sure where all of them went. But I'm just happy that they're gone now. So <laughs> um, yeah, so that is how I got rid of my fruit fly problem in a couple of hours. So that's really good because um, whenever I was, I was kind of watching them in here for a while just to like see if they were going into the trap or anything. Um, but then we ended up going and getting pizza and stuff. So um, we just came back, watched a movie and stuff, and then I decided to check on them and it, they're like all gone now. So that's really good. I'll just have to, and now I'll just clean all of it out and it looks, and uh, hopefully they won't come back again. Um, but if this ever happens again, I may try a different method like to get rid of them just to like show you guys different ways that you can do it. Like if you don't want to do the apple cider vinegar thing, um, just in case if you guys ever get them, because I do think it's a pretty common problem to get these in your hermit crab tanks and everything because you know, they're attracted to all the fruit and everything. And yeah, so I think that's going to be all for this video. So thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.